Hi, if you're like me, you know The Golden Girls 1985 is one of the best sitcoms of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun if you put up a chair by the campfire and watch it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's see together. Miles Webber is played back to Harold Gold. In 1985 when filming, he was 62 years old, and sadly on September 11, 2010, he passed away at the age of 86 in Woodland Hills, California, USA. What's wrong? Rose? I can explain. No, I understand. Oh, Rose, of course, you're dating. That's why I've come to a decision. I'm going to go to Washington. I'm going to talk to the Bureau. I am... I'm, 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 <laughs> sir, I'm Harold Gould. <laughs> In any case, uh, that was a, uh, that was a, a, a terrific experience. This is, this is a family I will never... Angelo is played by actor Bill Dana. In 1988, when filming, he was 64 years old. And sadly, on June 15, 2017, he passed away at the age of 92 in Nashville, Tennessee, USA. Quite ironically, in a banana packing plant. <laughs> Why was that ironical? Excuse me, I'm, I must have made a mistake in my English. Elevator operator, we, we made him into a bellman. And I used the name Park Central Hotel because I, Gene Wood... Dorothy Bornock is played by actress B. Arthur. As a substitute teacher and mother, she is introverted, compassionate and fiercely protective of those she considers her family. She was 63 years old when filming in 1985, and sadly on April 25, 2009, she passed away at the age of 86 in Los Angeles, California, USA. It was packed for the weekend. <laughs> Dorothy, you don't resent me, do you? Oh, don't be silly, don't, why would I resent you? Well, please. We call under fives. Meaning if it was if you had under five lines, it was they had to pay you very little. And I would uh, be called on to work doing Michael Bornock is played by actor Scott Jacoby. In 1986 when filming, he was 30 years old, and now he's living out his life at the age of 66. The two families together Sunday? Oh terrific idea. I can't wait to meet her. <laughs> Before you do, Mom, there is something about her you should know. Lorraine is kind of black. Start nodding their head. That's what the payoff is, that's what the art of this is. How do you achieve that? Well, it actually reminds me of that old... Blanche Devereaux is played by actress Rue McClanahan. She's a southern beauty working as an art museum. She was 51 years old when filming in 1985, and sadly on June 3, 2010, she passed away at the age of 76 in New York City, USA. Our class. For six consecutive hours, I was on my back while dozens of eligible men pressed their lips to mine and breathed air into my limp little body. Back And of course, he loved what I did. I loved what I did. Two, three days later, Betty White and I are called in together and he says, I would like to hear... Gary Tucker is played back to Jerry Harden. In 1986, when filming, he was 57 years old. And now he's living out his life at the age of 93. Don't do that. Uh, actually, there's something I want to talk to you about. What is it, Gary? Rose, I find you very attractive. The award, and that Did you was... get some land? No. <laughs> did you get I a didn't... ham? No, no, Mary Martin got the land. <laughs> she and did? The hand. But I think the land was vertical, so... I... Rose Nyland is playback actress Betty White. She is one of Rose's roommates. In 1985, when filming, she was 63 years old. And sadly, on December 31st, 2021, she passed away at the age of 99 in Los Angeles, California, USA. Get remarried, and our relationship is getting much more serious, and he just asked me to dinner to talk about something important. Believe me, he's going to ask me to marry him. Jockey, and he was there for the first two years of the show, and then he moved over to uh, ABC when, when the, the industry... Agent Bell is played by actor Timothy Stack. In 1990, when filming, he was 36 years old, and now he's living out his life at the age of 68. I have pictures. <laughs> so do we. <laughs> now, our records show that you come from a town called St. Olaf. I'll give him the discount. Just put that thing away. <laughs> this squares us. Could I just have been... Out! We'll see you, Dwayne. Stan Bornick is playback to Herb Edelman. 
He was Dorothy's cheating, parasitic ex-husband who left her for a young flight attendant who later left him. In 1985 when filming, he was 52 years old, and sadly on July 21st, 1996, he passed away at the age of 62 in Los Angeles, California, USA. <laughs> you always could slam a door, that's one of the things I love about it. You flatter me. <laughs> Max Weinstock is played by actor Jack Gilford. In 1988 when filming, he was 79 years old, and sadly on June 4th, 1990, he passed away at the age of 81 in Manhattan, New York City, New York, USA. Harry! Oh, Max, I love you with all my heart. The time we've spent together has been some of the happiest of my life, but my Darth. Salvador Bertrillo is played by actor Sid Melton. In 1987 when filming, he was 70 years old, and sadly on November 2nd, 2011, he passed away at the age of 94 in Burbank, California, USA. Everyone thinks heaven is right above. Actually, it's a little more to the left. <laughs> What's God like? Nice. Sophia Petrillo is played by actress Estelle Getty. She is Dorothy's mother. Born in Sicily, Sophia moved to New York after running away from an arranged marriage with Guido Sorelli. She was 62 years old when filming in 1985, and sadly on July 22, 2008, she passed away at the age of 84 in Los Angeles, California. Yes, Ma, what is it? That guy over there, is he a midget? Yes. Edna is played by actress Meg Willey. She was 70 years old when filming in 1987, and sadly on January 1st, 2002, she passed away at the age of 84 in Glendale, California, USA. My mind. Not even the one we could tell your father about how his car got dented while you were doing wheelies and not while it was sitting in the parking lot. What's your favorite character from The Golden Girls, and what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel and press the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you.